guys welcome to planning with crystal so today's unboxing is a glossy box for november 2021 so if you've watched my videos before you will probably know i am on the glossy box pr list which means the box is sent to me free of charge but i was a glossy box subscriber before that happened so it's not like i'm unboxing it just because it's sent to me and as usual with me and this channel you'll always get my honest opinions so this month's glossy box theme is beauty desires and if you are new to glossy box you can get your first box for 10 pounds using my discount code which i'll put on the screen and all the details will be below but generally it retails at 13.25 per month including free uk delivery it says hey glosses this month we're all about embracing elegant timeless beauty and our beauty desires glossy box is sure to give your chilly november days a sophisticated touch let us tempt you with soft silk light textures that caress your skin and irresistibly rich makeup must-haves that will enhance your inner radiance so as usual with this video i'm going to unbox it show you everything that's inside i'll tell you what size things are how much each individual item is worth and at the end of the video i'll tell you how much the total box is worth and then i will tell you the sneak peek we've got for december we already know what one of the items is going to be it's listed here in this little booklet so i'll share that with you when we get to it if you haven't seen my glossy box advent calendar unboxing i'll put a card here you can check that out i've done a whole advent calendar playlist if you're still on the hunt for your perfect advent calendar i would definitely suggest that you check it out so without further ado we're going to dive right in so this month we're in back to like a standard pink glossy box last month we got like a really funky one a little eye mask and stuff but this month we're back to our kind of traditional then we've got a little black ribbon around it and the pink tissue paper Ooh. okay so this is not at all included in the actual beauty items but there is a little sweet treat propped on the top so these are by thornton's and they're thornton's pearls it's a share the delight so these are a little bag of little individual chocolates so we get two individually wrapped chocolates we get a salted caramel sensation and a hazelnut delight plus a pound off a bag of thornton's pearls so that's nice because i do love a little chocolate treat so i'm always happy when they include things like that so this is the first thing i see and this is actually a fragrance so this is by a brand called commodity now i am actually familiar with commodity it was a really expensive kind of fragrance company i think it might have disappeared around 2012 a while ago now but they used to be stocked in places like space nk and they were all on a theme so i remember i bought something from them called book and it had like that scent of like an old book library sort of scent which sounds horrible doesn't it to some people but i like the smell of books so i loved it the one that we get in here is actually called paper so it's a five mil or 0.17 fluid ounce size it's got a little qr code on the back says so scan me so you can kind of open it and it will tell you a little bit more about it and it says on the side scent space personal for me and the few i allow close so it's in some super sleek fancy packaging which is kind of synonymous with this brand and it's a little spray bottle i've never actually tried this particular scent oh it's just like a nice kind of delicate scent doesn't really smell of paper but it just smells nice and kind of fresh so it says top tip make perfumes last longer by storing them in a dark dry space this is a mini it's actually worth 13 pounds in this five mil size so that should give you a clue as how expensive these perfumes actually are it's a deluxe mini and it says this molecular skin scent combines woody iso e super with touches of sweet amber for a lightweight and effortless glow that comes alive on skin part of commodities personal scent space collection paper is an intimate skin scent that embodies the concept of less is more and this is definitely one that i don't think anybody will dislike it's so kind of gentle and natural smelling i mean you can smell it but it's not offensive it's not going to give you a headache it's not powerful and over the top i think this is kind of the sort of sense quite neutral and most people enjoy so quite a good one to kind of have in a box like this where you don't get to choose it yourself then i think this might have been our sneak peek last month this is a palette by elf which stands for eyes lips and face it's 3.5 grams or 0.12 ounces and it's the bite size shadow palette in berry bad it's cruelty free and vegan i'm gonna have a look at some swatches in just a second so it is just simple kind of plastic packaging this is plastic that's plastic there's no mirror or anything like that so it comes in these four shades it's a full size worth four pounds 
This is prep your lids before you apply with your favourite eyeshadow primer, which I always do anyway, and definitely recommend you would do. A little compact that will have a big impact. This on the go eyeshadow quad features a combo of matte and shimmer shades that will perfectly take you from day to night. Rich, highly blendable and in gorgeous soft pink and berry red colours, you're sure to make a statement, whether that's minimalist or dramatic. So I would say these are quite nice autumnal shades, aren't they? So that's like one little swatch of the first one. I'm going to put a little bit more on just so you can kind of see it more clearly. That's a nice kind of base shade. Then the other ones are a bit more kind of heavily pigmented. So I've done them from here to the other way in that order. So hopefully that kind of helps you see what the shades are. Then we've got a full size product by Human and Kind and I really really like some of the body care items we've had from them before. They just smell gorgeous. So this is a two in one moisturising hand scrub with elderflower and raspberry. It's 75 mils or 2.5 fluid ounces. It's naturally derived, it's vegan, it's humane. The perfect solution to soften your hands, feet and elbows without drying them out. Shea butter, sunflower oil, red raspberry seed and elderberry extract make our hand scrub great to exfoliate and moisturise all your dry rough parts, removes dead cells and refines texture. Your skin is left smooth, soft and delicately fragrant. Apply liberally to wet or dry skin and scrub in with hands, rinse well afterwards. Well, with all the hand washing we're still doing, this will be a nice little touch. It says, rinse the scrub off with cold water afterwards to keep hands feeling fresh. This is worth £12.85 and it says, for super soft hands we have the answer. Because this scrub gently cleanses your skin to leave your hands feeling better than ever. Dried raspberry seeds delicately yet effectively remove dead skin cells while shea butter and sunflower oil ensure your hands feel hydrated and smooth. Oh. That smells so good. You definitely get that raspberry scent, but it's like a natural raspberry scent. That smells really good. I'll be popping this next to the sink to wash my hands with shortly because that ugh, smells divine. Next up, we have got a product by E Cooking, and this is their cleansing gel. And I think we've had this in another beauty box quite recently. So this is for normal to oily skin. It's got vitamin E and cucumber extract, and it's vegan. It's actually a really good cleanser. So it's got some decent ingredients in it is really gentle and just a really nice one to use really. It says work the gel into a lather in your hands and apply to your face and neck morning and evening. The nourishing formula deeply yet gently cleanses your skin suitable for normal or oily skin rinse with water. And this is in a 125 mils or 4.2 fluid ounce size. It's a full size and it's worth £14.30. Containing ingredients such as organic sunflower oil that are moisturising and nourishing, you'll wonder why this cleansing gel wasn't already a part of your skincare routine. Deeply refreshing your skin and removing unwanted impurities, it's perfect for your face, neck and décolletage. Randomly, we have got a little bubble gum in here and this is the Refreshers Extra Bubble Mint. I think I spoke about this before, we got this in a box once before and I know it's a bit random but these are my absolute favourite bubble gums and my children's as well. So I actually like these little individual ones because I can just like pop them in my handbag in case I want a gum when I'm out and about. I find gum, as well as like refreshing the mouth, which these really do, as the name would suggest with refresher, as well as that, and as well as the fact they taste really good, they also help me concentrate chewing, that sort of chewing motion. It just seems to help me focus when I'm trying to focus on something at work. I actually find chewing quite helpful. I'm sure there's some science or something behind that, but it seems to work for me. Next up, we've got a little sort of beauty blender thing. It's by a brand called Karina. It says, for seamless blending of makeup, wet your blender before use. I'm sure most of us use beauty blenders or something similar. I certainly do. So this is a full size worth £8.50. And it says, because glosses always need a beauty blender. We all use them most days after all. In a gorgeous glossy box pink shade, this beauty blender is perfect for applying your foundation, concealer, liquid blush, bronzer and highlight. Getting into hard to reach areas with ease, it'll blend makeup to perfection so you can achieve the ultimate flawless finish. And it is nice just to replace these as well. And actually you could save this little resealable bag and put it in there if you were traveling with it. It doesn't say anything else on it anywhere, it is just what it is. I know it's not the most exciting thing but it is probably one of the more useful things you could be given in a box. So to recap this month's box before we go into spoiler territory and I'll obviously let you know how much this month's box is worth, we have got the cleansing gel, full size, hand scrub, also full size, full size mini eye palette, the deluxe sample size of the perfume, 
and the Beauty Blender sponge, plus the little samples of chocolate and gum as well, random or what. I'll put on the screen how much this month's box is worth. And then on to December sneak peek. Inspired by the magic of winter, our December Moonlight Glow Glossy Box is packed with products that'll add a winter glow. And that, of course, includes our first sneak peek. From LA Splash, the Midnight Glow Face Palette will help you to enhance your complexion's natural luminosity. Worth £25, it's an essential in your beauty bag during the upcoming festive season. It also goes on to kind of do a bit of an advertisement talking about Black Friday and saying there's going to be lots of limited editions, mystery boxes, so that's quite exciting. So yeah, fun. Like I said, I'll put links and everything underneath, discount codes if you want to sign up to Glossy Box. This box is medium to fab for me. It's got a lot of products in it I will use. The cleansing gel is really good. I am really happy with the hand scrub and the perfume as well. So I'm quite excited to use a few of these. And this actually doesn't look bad for a £4 eyeshadow palette. It actually looks pretty impressive. But we'll see. I'll have to play around with them and just kind of blend it a bit more and just see how they work. Let me know in the comments what do you think of this month's Glossy Box selection. Are you signed up or will you be signing up? Let me know what you think. I would love it if you give this video a thumbs up. It lets me know you're enjoying the content I'm producing. And I'd love it if you'd subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell to be notified when my next video goes live. As usual, I've got lots and lots of advent calendar unboxings, beauty unboxings, gift with purchase unboxings, and all that good stuff coming. So make sure you're subscribed and notified of that. And I'm also really close to 10,000 subscribers, which was my mission for 2021. So if you would be willing to subscribe, if you are new, then I would really appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.